Homemade breadcrumbs for coating chicken fillets. So easy to do. Toaster, crumb tray, breadcrumbs. Fucking done. So my dentist recently recommended to me that I get an electric toothbrush, but I'm super cheap and all the nice ones are like super expensive. So I have a different plan. Vlog three, Negro, once again with the e-boy at Build-A-Bear Workshop. There were so many damn choices of stuffed animals to choose from, but you know, I had to go with the baby Negro. It looks just like Papa. Made my own sound, but it was low-key copyright, so I can't play it. I then watched my newborn baby boy stretch out the womb and get his back blown out, just like the girl I was talking to, who said she was just hanging with a friend, but I guess this will build character. Then came up with a cute wish and stuffed my son on some Alabama shit. Pause. He looked just like his daddy. You already know the deal. Then a hugs hoodie because he low key a soft boy like me. And some simple denim jeans to complete the fit. Gave him a little cute nickname like all the females gonna be calling him. I am now a single father taking applications for a mother. Should I really even start? Meow, meow, nigga! 
So, I saw someone use one of these to, like, take their contacts out. And I never used it, so I'm gonna use it, okay? And you're gonna see me do it. Okay, I'm fucking scared. Ow! That was suctioning my fucking eye. Did you just... <sighs> that didn't feel right. That didn't feel right. That, that did not fucking feel right. I feel like my eyeball almost just came out weird. Do you see that? That's not right. That's not... That can't be safe. That can't be healthy. You, my little friend, are fucking... <laughs> I don't like that. My interpretation of when a Christian says you need Jesus. Excuse me. I think you need Jesus. Because your lifestyle isn't okay. Huh? Good morning, Angel. How did you sleep? Excellent. Look, I didn't want to wake you up because that would be rude of me. So I'm leaving you this message for the day. And that is I love you. You're not good enough for my daughter in any respect. You're not worthy. I don't think you'll ever be able to take care of her. I took care of her while you were in prison. These children are facing death right now. But with your support and just 50 cents a day, we can save them. Please go online. Call. Yes. Oh, bro, I got you. I got you. I have important news. I have an idea. It's a stupid one, but it's entertaining. Just, just hear me out, okay? You know that classic move at parties that girls like to do to show off their buns? And they call it twerking, but it's an odd form of twerking. There's not really a name for it, and I have discovered in my own little thoughts a new name for it. Let me show you what I am talking about. It's where you lift one leg and then you're like, you shake, shake that ass. Do you know what that reminds me of? Are you picking up what I'm putting down? What I am proposing is we call it hiking the leg like a dog. Because like you lift a leg, you know, and you're like, Ugh, does it does it not make does it not make sense? I think my dog would agree. Give me a rusty boy. It is dog approved. Putting a stamp on it, it's official. We are calling it hiking the leg. <laughs> it's negative three degrees out. And I gotta make it up this <laughs> mountain by tomorrow morning or I die. Let's go. <laughs> it's not funny. <laughs> my pick was backwards and my snot is freezing and I pissed myself five times. <laughs> Let me drive the bus. Just ride the bus down. Loud thunder, heavy rain, thin line between joy and pain. It's a long, strange trip. It's all insane. You ain't never gonna be the same. Living life through the night, thin line. What's up, motherfuckers? Me again. Have you heard my new song? It's called Pissing Out Maggot Shit. My loneliness is killing me and I must confess A bit harder, yo. I'm a rider, provider. Bring the heat, yeah. I'm up with the fire.
Baby doll, look at me. I want to force you up against this wall, restrain you by your fragile wrists, and punish you until you're shaking. Do you understand? I was running through the six with my wife. Please don't go, please don't go. I love you so, I love you so. Please don't go, please don't go. I love you so, I love you so. Please pray Get your bread, make it like a cute little sandwich for the kiddos. Cheese, ham, bread, some mayo. Okay. I see. Where, I see where this is going. It's cute. I wish. I wish I knew how to like meal prep like this. That's okay. More mayo. I'm not a big mayo person, but you know, to each their own. Avocado. Ooh. That's a lot of mayo. I think that's... No. No. Are they making a mayo cake? No, 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 no. This, this is not happening. Mm, no! That's so much mayo! No! Who the fuck? Oh my god, they turned it into a cake. It's a mayo cake! Crab and soap. Crab and soap. Crab in soap. Crab in soap. Crab in soap. Crab in soap. Where'd you say you found this brownie? Oh, in the bottom of our son's closet. That's kind of like a uh, such a that's such a weird spot for food, don't you think? Yeah, you're right. That is kind of a that is kind of a weird spot to keep food. I don't know why he'd want to hide it. This brownie's pretty good. We, I think we got a little chef on our hands. He, he's a good kid. We, I love our son. Like, I, I don't know. I'm just feeling really emotional right now. <laughs> we were, we're the best parents. Is all I'm saying. <laughs> Where's the bag? 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 Fellas, if your girlfriend has an unnatural hair color, at least two tattoos, is in her twenties and still listens to My Chemical Romance, and has daddy issues, I'm sorry to tell you this. But that's not your girlfriend. That's me. I'm your girlfriend now. Tell me I'm pretty, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> it's the cake. Can I stop for just two seconds? <laughs> 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 oh my god. You said what I said. Moving on to our next one. Hmm. <laughs>